Hey you guys, it's your girl Aisha, aka Miss November 21, and I'm back with another video. However, if you are new to this channel, please go ahead and smash that like button. Also, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And while you're at it, go ahead and hit that bell so you don't miss out on any videos that I may be posting. Alrighty, so with that being said, if you are a person who enjoys being alone, who enjoys being to yourself, and you find it hard to, you know, make friends and be around others, and you feel like you're just very different from everyone else, this is the channel for you. So if that already resonated with you, go ahead and while you're at it to put down in the comments, I'm a loner, okay? Let them know already that you're a loner, okay? You don't need nobody. You don't need no friends. You don't need no family. You don't need anyone to make you feel valuable or to make you feel like you're someone, okay? All you need is yourself. Okay, that's all you will ever need is yourself. Okay, that's all you will ever need is yourself. And it makes you feel good because you know, at the end of the day, all you know is that you got a smile on your face. People will make you feel lesser because you might see your homegirl or your homeboy and they might got a boyfriend or a girlfriend, but they may try to make you feel like, oh, she ain't got no boyfriend or he ain't got no girlfriend. They might try to make you feel like, you know, try to make you jealous of them or try to make you feel some type of way because you ain't got nobody in your corner. But at the end of the day, boo, you already know what it is. Like, that stuff don't excite you. You know what it's like to have a boyfriend. You know what it's like, guys, to have a girlfriend. You know what it's like. You know, you done been there and you done done that. You the type, you don't need a whole group. You, you don't run in a pack. You you ride solo dolo. And while you at it, y'all put down in the comments, baby, I'm solo dolo. Like, I don't need nobody to ride for me. Because at the end of the day, you ride for yourself. You slide by yourself. And see, that's why a lot of people don't really rock with you like that. Because they see that you're the type. You stand up for yourself. You don't allow other people to speak for you. Have y'all ever just been in a situation? And put this down in the comments too. Like, Have y'all ever just been in a situation where you find yourself where someone will butt in and they find themselves trying to speak for you or to answer for you. If you have ever experienced something like that, go ahead and also put that down in the comments and tell me how you felt. You know, just the fact that somebody trying to speak for you or, you know, like they own you. Somebody asked you a question, but they hop in and try to speak for you like they're you. Like, Put that down in the comments like let me know what had happened and let me know what you said and how you reacted to it. But anyway, with that being said, if you are enjoying this channel so far, like I say, smash that like button. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, smash that like button. If you want to see more videos like this, if you are resonating with the things that I am saying, if it's giving you some type of awakening in your spirit, if it's waking you up, if it's making you realize things that you didn't realize before, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell, boo, okay? <laughs> but anyways, like I was saying, yes. Like, sometimes people get to the point where you irritate them you irritate them every time you come around you irritate them you know you you could be dressed nice sometimes you can just have on plain clothes and look regular you still irritate them they might give you that stank look they might look at you like you got some on your face or anything it could be anything they just look at you like you know like and then in your head, you're just like, dang, I ain't even doing nothing. All I did was step in the room and like they already mad. Like, that's because you got it like that. You got it like that and you will forever have it like that. And practically nine times out of ten, it's things that us chosen ones go through behind closed doors that people to this day, that some people will never know or even realize it. 
on top of that, with that being said, the fact that we are chosen, we were handpicked. We were chosen by God. God chose us. He wanted us to be a light unto this world. And the fact that we are a light unto this world, which I'm meaning, when people see us, they see that we're always smiling. They see that we're always happy. We're always have this big smile on our face. We always make people laugh. We are the fun. We are the fun. We get the party jumping. We get the party going. You like, before we stepped in the room, everybody was just like, Then when we step in a room, everybody like, uh, oh yeah, uh, what, what you say, what, what, what you say? Like, people be like getting lit all of a sudden, then you be like, dang, like, where did all this energy come? Because at first it was just dry in here, and now everybody just like, you know, just like, you know, trying to show out. You will see somebody looking at you, catch your eye, that you caught their eye, they look at you, then they play like they don't see you. Like, people do that because you know how we, we, we the chosen ones. And on top of that, with that being said, we are undefeated. People will try to play you in your face, but on top of that, you really be seeing through people. You be seeing through the lies. You be seeing through all of it and that's the crazy part and that's what a lot of people don't be realizing in today's world you know god gifted the chosen ones with all these special gifts and abilities and we know how to use them to a certain extent and people don't be realizing that people think oh they can just look at you and lie to you but it but in the back of your head you the chosen one you like okay like okay you think i'm dumb i'm gonna play dumb okay yeah you lying to me okay i already know you lying all right yeah you said that oh, okay but i know you just already said such and such to this person like you already knowing what's going on before it even happened it's kind of like almost to the fact that you are chosen one it's like a simple fact some days you get deja vu you will see a vision or something picture in your head before it already happened and then the next thing you know you already sitting right in that vision that you visualized you know, it's 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 amazing in a way because God will give us downloads. He will give us things, show us things that other people don't see. He will only show it to us. And that's the great thing about it. He will only show it to us and only us. And I think it's it's cool. It's cool in a way and I love it. I'm grateful for it. I'm grateful for the 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 powers that the Lord has given us along the way. And on top of that, you scare people. Us chosen ones, we scare a lot of people. Like, put this down in the comments. Like, I need to know from somebody. Because like I say, I know I'm not alone. Like, I know I'm not on this YouTube channel talking to myself. I know. Hey, you over there on the other side of the screen. Put down in the comments. Like, have you ever ran across somebody and you had a good conversation? Y'all was chopping it up. You was getting to know each other. And as y'all got to know each other day by day, it also got a, had a little awkward moment. And then the other person was like, oh, you, you scared me. You scared me. And then in your head, you like, what you mean? Like, I didn't do nothing to scare you. You know you didn't scare them. But in their mind, they're thinking, like, you scare them. They see something in you that they ain't never seen. They see something in you, boo, that they ain't never seen. What the Lord say, no eyes haven't seen, no ears haven't heard. They see something in you that they have not ever seen, boo. And the fact that they came across you, they, they, they shaking, they, they scared. They, they, they don't realize what they see. They don't realize who you are. They scared. They scared as crap right now. They don't know who you is. But it's gonna come a day where it's gonna all be revealed. Everybody who mistreated you, everybody who did you wrong, everybody who threw your name, dragged your name in the mud, and you wasn't nothing but nice to these people. You gave them a you gave them your last. You gave these people rise. You let these people live with you. You did all these things for these people. And they just threw you and dragged you in the mud when you needed help, they wasn't there for you. When you need a dollar, they couldn't even give you a dollar. When you needed a ride, they couldn't even give you a ride. When you were struggling and had no job, they didn't give you a place to stay. They didn't give you nothing to eat. 
And that's what they not realizing. But you know what? Us chosen ones, we we so lit to the fact that everybody who has done us wrong, I guarantee you that today. Put that down in the comments and let me know if there is anybody in your life who has ever done you wrong and they have came back. They have came back to you apologizing or they have came back asking you for help. Put that down in the comments and let me know if that has ever happened to you. Out of everybody that's done you wrong, they came back needing you needing your help needing your support needing money needing something from you and that's because you're chosen you are a child of god you are untouched the bible say touch not my anointed and do my prophet no harm so these people messed up when they crossed you they crossed the wrong person they did not realize who you were but they are going to see who you are it's finna be revealed god is setting out his people He's setting them out. He, 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 he finna get ready to do some things. Like I say, that no eyes haven't seen, no ears haven't heard. But if you are enjoying this video, I'm gonna cut it short right now, boo, because like I say, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead right now, boo, and hit that smash, smash that like button. Smash that like button. Click subscribe, y'all. I am on our journey we are on a roll we are on a roll right now and you need to come on and just join join right now because this channel is finna get real it's finna get good and i don't want you guys to miss out on any of it like i say if you have any questions or concerns or things you need to ask go ahead and feel free and put it down in the chat i don't mind communicating to you about these things i don't mind talking about these things on my channel because you know we family we're we're a team so we got to come together so i thank you guys i appreciate you if you made it this far if you made it this far big hearts to you I'm sending my love, I'm sending peace, I'm sending prosperity, I'm sending abundance, I'm sending blessings and miracles, happy, all of it. I'm sending it your way because you know why? You deserve it. And don't ever let no one make you feel like you don't deserve to be loved because you deserve to be loved more than anybody. You deserve to be loved. You know why? Because you're chosen. You were destined for this. You were built like this. You were made like this. And can't nobody stop it. Baby, you unstoppable. And with that being said, I'm signing out. All right, baby. It's your girl, Aisha. Peace.